microbrews are becoming quite popular at Mexico City's trendy bars. In the Condesa neighborhood, drinkers are opting for the more acquired tastes offered by the country's smaller niche breweries instead of the big labels that have traditionally been more popular. The volume is a little less, but the product is better produced. At the end of the day, it tastes better. Customers at El Deposito are sipping on both locally produced and imported beers, and the manager says the market has big potential. It's growing day by day. There aren't that many places here selling these sorts of products yet, but it's growing bit by bit. Bjorn Nelson is the master brewer at Calavera Microbrewery tucked away in the state of Mexico on the border of Mexico City. He can vouch for that. They turn out 2,500 liters of beer a week. When we started three years ago, there were three big breweries and a handful of little ones. Now there's more than you can count with both hands, more than 40. Mexico's two major industrial brewers have been sold off to foreign companies. That, according to the experts, opens the way for brewers like Calavera to cash in on patriotic patrons who want to keep their beer consumption local. The growth of the middle class has people turning to more interesting, novel products on the market that cost just a little bit more. Back at El Deposito, the range of beers on tap assures that there is something to cater to every taste. And Mexican consumers are drinking it up. That's the story. Thanks for watching. From Medellin, Colombia, I'm Brian Andrews reminding you that we've got Latin America covered for you in English. Fashion, lifestyle, culture, and travel news from the greatest cities in the Americas. Always online right here at brianandrews.us.